Hi, today we're going to be looking at the game Lords of Waterdeep. It plays two to five players, it takes around 45 minutes to an hour, and it is a worker placement resource management game. Each of you starts off with a faction, which determines your color, a secret lord, which determines bonus points for the end of the game, and some quests, intrigue cards, and agents in your pool. Now the game consists of eight rounds, so you have to plan your strategy well, and at the fifth round, everyone gains an extra agent to speed up the play towards the end. So each round consists of you and your opponents placing agents in iconic buildings around the city of Waterdeep. Now let's take a look at some of these buildings. If you place someone in Cliff Watch Inn, that is where you can gain new quests, and the quests are what you need to gain victory points. In Waterdeep Harbor, that's where all the intrigue happens, and these cards can help or hinder yourself or your opponents. In one of these regular spots here, that is how you can gain the resources to try and complete your quests to gain the victory points. In Builder's Hall, you can build a new building, which opens up new possibilities and new spots to place your agents, and also gives the owner of that building a bonus if someone else uses it. At the end of the eighth round, everyone reveals their lord, and that gives them bonus points for certain quest types. So if you like backstabbing your friends, gaining resources, then you'll love Walls of Waterdeep. So come on down to Across the Board to check it out.